I love making popcorn. But I'm really interested in how this little kernel gets to become that fluffy morsel that we call popcorn. And I'm particularly interested in what is in this that's the same or different than what's in the, the kernel that I'm going to get. So what I would like to do is use my scale here, take my kernel, compare it how it is now on the scale to when it's been popped. But the problem is one kernel, it's hard to keep track of it. My scale doesn't even register it. It says zero grams. But a couple kernels, four kernels, kernels? Well, I just might need more. So I'm going to use all of these kernels. A whole batch. But first I need to know what I'm doing. So I'm going to take my bucket, which is going to catch all of these kernels, because it's going to be a big mess later on. I need to have a catcher. I'm going to put it on my scale. My scale says that is 95 grams. Record my data. But then I need to know how much all of these kernels are. It says all my kernels in the bucket. Hundred and sixty six grams. Which is more. That's good. Means my kernels must mass out to be hundred and sixty six minus ninety five. That's right. Well that would be sixty six and five, which would be seventy one grams. Seventy one grams of kernels. Yeah. Okay. I wonder, after they're popped, what that's going to be like. Stunning video footage is about to transpire. Put these in the popper. Every last one, no kernel left behind ready to be caught in the bucket, and I'll show you this up close. Here we go. Get ready. wanted to make sure I caught that before it turned. Make sure we dump this all out into the bucket. Hot. And as much room, there's one stuck. There we go. Empty. Full. I really want to eat some of that. But instead, I've got my zeroed scale, my bucket plus popcorn plus pop. I'm going to weigh this originally. The bucket by itself, 95. Kernels, 166. Let's see what happened. This is high drama science. Bing, 
Do, do, do. Bucket plus popcorn, 158. Huh. Pot. Do all my own filming, stunts, and science. What does that mean? Well, I guess that's something for us to figure out. Okay.